All right, gang, welcome back. I don't know if you recall, but we are hot on the heels of one hum grump. Good to have you back. How you been? We buried him. Good. <laughs> are they just tormenting like little little beach critters? Nice and cozy like. We're totally justified in doing this. <laughs> How'd you like these beautiful pink sands of yours now? A eh, little starfish. We got we, we to rescue the starfish. Yo, bozos. This is exactly the type of thing that's earned you a terrible rep. Troublesome persons. Get them. All right. These guys need a walloping. Yo, Thrash, you going to do anything, bro? You going to feel free to jump in anytime, pal. There's only one fella who could dig my man out of there. Toomba. 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 A little round flamingo. He is good at digging. Find Toomba so he can dig up my sweetheart. You got it, Mrs. Starfish. Uh, any advice on where we'd find this Toomba, dude? Well, now, around this time, you usually find him napping under a tree. Sleepy bird, that one. Jot, I've been scoping this place out since we got here. Didn't see any round sleepy dudes under any trees. Maybe you could spot who we're after. From a different vantage point? Ah, mmm. I smell what you're stepping in. Oh no. Hmm. Oh, there we go. Ubi, what's that? There's a starfish buried, huh? This be a job for Toomba. <laughs> you lead the way. Uh, can I get out of here? Can I just go ahead and... Boogie Beach. Jot and Tumba beheld the funky land of Boogie Beach. Mm. The story changes a little bit. Tumba. Ooh, that starfish been buried bad. Let's see what Tumba can do. <laughs> Man, it looks so easy. Stanley. I think Boogie are all right. Stanley's none plus. The sand. So deep. So endless. Millions of tiny primordial stones. Stanley? Banging job, Tumba, dude. But it'd be nothing. <laughs> we're, we're almost done with his arc, and I finally decided to start giving him the intended accent. You both be here to stop all the bad business. My awful, awful Jamaican accent. <laughs> Help you, Tumba will. Tumba's not big, but knows these beaches. And has a shovel, can dig up you things. Tumba, dude. That'd be rad. We could use your help. You got it. Let's roll. I. Um. Hold on. Can I talk to these guys? And countless grains of sand. Like moments in time. He's having, he's having like an existential crisis. <laughs> Apparently it's totally seized up, won't open. Some associate didn't fill out the gear grease access forms. Very poor paperwork. A clear case of, clear case for a naughty associate behavioral report form. As clear a case I have ever seen, Soldier Dob. Wait, is that, are they troublesome persons? Yes, we are. I love, Thrash has really found his balls in this chapter and I am here for it. <laughs> That's right, dude. I'm about to be a fucking problem. <laughs> well, that'd be a big get. 
Yo, hey, it's Violet, everybody. Just hanging out in the bushes. Oh, hello, gang. I found you. Violet, what the? Where did? Huh? Moonbeard didn't tell you? Oh, well, I suppose he wouldn't. He's very busy. I finished up mixing my potion. So old MB sent me here to help you two gents. Wait, who's this little pink birdie? He's so darn cute. Doomba is the name. Doomba digs holes. <laughs> I'm gonna bite my tongue because I feel like there was a dirty joke there. And this game's too cute for me to be like super raunchy. Toomba has been helping us navigate the beaches. Help a dude. Hey, it's been a while. Triple trouble reunited. Give me the pose. Yeah. Uh. <laughs> you three is dancing good. Tumba can't dance, but Tumba can dig. And Tumba can find things that others can't. Tumba show you. Get him, Tumba. Tumba thinking this path will take you where you're heading. All right. Thanks, Tumba. Are the palm trees wearing, uh, like Macho Man Randy Savage glasses? Is that, am I just seeing that wrong? I need to find uh, the key for this. Found some artwork. And we got the key. All right. I love that I got a little tribe with me now. Buccaneer Bay, water stretch to the east and west. Army hearties, you're in Buccaneer Bay now. If you guys want to be leaving, you best open the gate ahead. And if you guys want to be opening that gate, you best be finding two shiny jewels. But if you guys want to stay, you could come live with me on me rock. All right, those are all solid options. Let me think it over. I'm gonna bat it around for a little while. Hold on. All right. Do I get anything from killing these guys? Nope. All right. Is there anything for me to dig up? All right. Water. Water was the word, right? All right. Water. What are all the abilities I have? Ah, there we go. How do I bring Toomba over here with me? Go guys. Guys. Alright. <laughs> okay. Hmm. out jump in murder these guys lower this wall get this jewel oh. all right <clears throat> one down Okay. This is what we do. All right, one, two, three. And there we go. All right. Oh, 
don't know if I've commented on all the little walls and obstructions having cute little faces and handlebar mustaches, but I love it. All right, you went and solved the puzzle of the bay, didn't you? You'll be on your way now, no doubt. Won't be living with me on me rock. Roger understands. Life on a rock ain't for everyone. Good luck, me hearties. All right. I like that he's a understanding pirate, right? It's not typically one of the traits people talk about. Uh, little Tumba, are we going the right way? Tumba knows these beaches like the back of his wing. Tumba won't be letting you down. Okay, Tumba. Ugh. I'm having a grand old time today playing this. I took the best nap today. I got to go to work tonight, but I, I feel like I'm going to be bright eyed and bushy tailed. Well, those things look mean. Yeah, like they'll blast our heads off if we try mooching past. Hello, my chickadees. Looks like you're getting close to the heart of grumpiness. Thrash is right. Those tanks will blast you into biscuits if you try to run past. But not if you blast them first. But with what? A guitar cello? No. With something that Jot can retrieve from the world outside. Hop to it, Jot. Moonbeard out. Moonbeard sounds busy. He still had a lot to do when I left. I hope he's remembering to hydrate. Anyway, Jot, sounds like you need an item from out there. Go do your jumpy thing. All right, jumpy thing it is. All right. Hmm. Was that a bomb stamp? We getting a bomb stamp? Mm okay. Hmm. All right, what's over here? All right, so I'm gonna have to deal with these. Look like Velociraptors, right? All right, let's do it. Am I helping this guy? My goodness, you're an unusual looking dinosaur. You have the look of someone who's on a mission. You're planning to scale the volcano, aren't you? Well, it's pretty dangerous. Take that primal axe over there. It'll give you the power to make it to the top. Do I get an axe and I get to keep it? This isn't a temporary thing like the bow and arrow, is it? Ah! Oh. Oh, yeah. Ooh, I love this. Oh. Oh. There's no way they let me keep this for the rest of the game. <laughs> I love even the look on his face is like super aggro now. Who's looking to get hacked up? Oh. Shit, I probably gotta run from this guy, right? He's a little too much for me to deal with. Okay. <laughs> I don't wanna see what happens if the T-Rex catches me. Oh, the spitter. What was it Dilophosaurus? I don't remember if that was right or not. All right. Okay. 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 Where, where am I? Okay. There's a glitch. Oop. I think there's a glitch. <laughs> Be right back. Hold on. We're back. It is the following day. Uh, I had to stop playing this game uh, because it started glitching out. I don't know how much that's going to be obvious uh, in the final cut of this episode. Uh, but yeah, I had to stop playing. I had to uninstall and reinstall the game uh, to get it to load properly. Because it just, it wouldn't load Jot. 
The game was stuck. All right. Couldn't progress. Who's this asshole? Time Tim. Well, hello. You managed quite an impressive feat of adventuring. Getting all the way up here. My name's Time Tim. A pleasure to meet you. I'm an adventurer too, you know. A time traveler, as a matter of fact. I like to visit all possible futures and histories to see what I can find. Here I found lots of pointy teeth and claws. All quite thrilling. Now, don't let me hold you up. You'd better leave the primal axe here. If it's removed, it could alter the course of history. Don't get me started on butterfly effects. All right, can I just get out of here now? Or do I still gotta talk to him? Excellent. The timelines are already quite messy as they are, you know. In return, something that you may find useful. All you had to do was get out of the fucking way. All right. Oh. Jot got the bomb stamp. Went on top of the book. Press L2 to stamp. Oh, got it. Oh, that's right. Okay. An explosive development. You acquired the bomb stamp. Get back to your book and cause some shockwaves. The path back is through here, Plucky Squire. Okay. Alright. Is that how I select things? Okay, so L trigger. Bomb stamp. Now oh, you take that. Alright. And you can have one. And you get a bomb. And you get a bomb. And you get a bomb. <laughs> All right. Everybody like that timely Oprah reference? All right, gang. Jot, those tanks, they suddenly just blew themselves up. It must have been from boredom. They've been sitting here in the same spot for ages. Wait. Dude, is this some kind of new plucky power of yours? Oh, whoa, Jot can blow stuff up now? Doomba dig, Jot blast, good combo. Mind blowing. Lead the way, Master Blaster. Uh, ahead lay dangerous looking machines, not anymore. All right, I feel like there's some stuff to, can I blow this stuff up? Is that what I was supposed to do? All right. Cause there was a, uh, that baby, right? From earlier. Wait, where is the little portal thing? Where is that obstacle right here? Okay. I think I can blow up this thing. Hopefully I don't blow up this baby. All right. All right there we go. Hey, what's up, baby? You found a fourth lost glitch bird. Glitch birds are highly curious creatures, but alas, not incredibly perceptive. This often leads to them becoming confused and lost. After a while, they become quite lonely and long to return to their homeland. Good job finding this one. Here we go. Hmm, these hum grumpy dudes really love their crates, huh? They have a real talent for blocking our way. Got anything, Toomba? Toomba thinking there'd be another way around. Jungle full of hidden places among trees. You clear the leaves, you find the way. Sounds promising, Jot. Maybe you could use that old plucky pizzazz. Take a look from above. Blast away some of the leaves. Okay. Just gonna start dropping explosives on the jungle wait there's something over here yeah ah okay hmm buy some over here too then okay
What's up, guys? All right. Murder, murder, murder. Kill, kill, kill. All right. Can I just walk back over on this other side? No. God damn it. Oh, oh. Uh, that, it's early in the morning now, guys. Uh, I did work last night. It was uh, somewhat of a long night. Oh, shit. Hold on. Maybe I can get by these guys without dealing with them. Yeah. Um. Hi. Uh, what are you guys up to? You think they're going to um let us in? The problem, Peeve, is that we don't have Operation Hammer Time clearance. Yes. Well, to be honest, I'm a bit disappointed about that. I've been filing all my paperwork very thoroughly and ironing my shirt every day, but still, no clearance. Now you mention it, your shirt has been looking very crisp. Oh, thank you. I'm glad someone noticed. <laughs> I mean, these guys do have their charm. You know, it has to be like the guys, like the stormtroopers and stuff on the Death Star. Like, it's just a job. They're not necessarily evil. Hello, gang. Those gates can't open from he them here. But there may be a switch further ahead. Just a thought. Moonbeard out. All right, so there's some. All right. There we go. Oh, there we go. Looks like you'll be the one forging ahead, dude. We'll cool our heels here while you find that switch. Uh, a large metal battery. All right, what are we looking for? Row of heavy gates blocked away. Any other sentences around here? Is that Mjolnir? We get Mjolnir in this game? Oh. Oh. I'm gonna be disappointed if we don't get Mjolnir now. Oh. Ah. Alright, come on. Oh, this guy's tough. Come on. Come on. Come on. Got him. It was a solitary goblet. Hmm. Maybe. Turn him back into a battery. Uh, there we go. Uh. these guys
All right, and we get a magic hammer. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Ahoy! Please catch up to me. All right, cool. Good work, Jot. Knew you'd nail it. Jot got it done. You got one of those thinking brains, dude. That's the key to your success. So, I guess the way is open. We can get to see what this Operation Hammer Time is all about. Let's get to it. Uh, Tumba? Head is where hum grump be hunkering. Don't be happy to got to have got you here. But Tumba has to be going home now. <laughs> got some mice to be feeding. Tumba dude, thank you so much for getting us here. Yeah, if it wasn't for you, we'd still be loitering behind that massive iron gate. You did amazing, Tumba. Tumba feel happy. Made some new friends today. Tumba can't dance, but Tumba dancing anyway. Get it, Tumba. Get it, Tumba. Get it, Tumba. Uh, uh. Did you just fucking bust out a windmill? <laughs> Tumba can't dance. Get out of here. Being modest. Time to feed the baby mice. So long and good luck, friends. There goes a righteous little duckling. Dark speed, Tumba. Okay. Come on, it's time to crash Humgrum's party. I feel like we're almost at the end of the game, no? Let's see. Uh, uh, uh. Oh. Beware, travelers. Real crazy things going on over that bridge. A ridge, excuse me. Our heroes climbed to a grassy vantage point and looked below to see an enormous clanking machine. Mm. He built a technodrome. From the machine rode scores of dangerous looking vehicles. Can okay, let's get out of the book and bomb them all? Which before our hero's eyes sped away towards Artia. Uh, that's no good. So that's what that grubby grump has been up to. Making tanks. Dangerous, dangerous things. And that's why he chose Boogie Beach. There's a direct line from the beach to castle, you know. Well, gang, this is a dire situation. Make no mistake. But you did good. You've given us warning. I'm briefing the queen and putting the armies of Ardia on highest alert. Now, you three, it's time to get back to Ardia. No time to waste. If we're going to defeat Humgrum's forces, we've got to do it together. Moonbeard out. This is heavy. Those tanks are rolling straight for my hometown. So the aim of Operation Hammer Time is to hammer Ardia Castle. We have to halt that hammer. Come on, let's go. And so our heroes sprinted off to Artia. Chapter eight, clash at the castle. All right. Mm, we're about to have a big boss fight. The gang arrived at Artia to see the aftermath of a great battle. The army of Artia had been thoroughly defeated. I love these colors. Forces. Well, Humgrum's minions have really done a number on this place. My town, this is a disaster. The Artian guards 
stands no more. Home comes forces. The metal beasts. All too much. I wasn't strong enough. Lucky Squire. Go. Defend the castle. Protect the queen. Alright, guys. I think we are... I'm grumpy. He's everywhere. <coughs> Look at your fancy town now, huh? It's our town now. We'll make it nice and comfy. You'll see. Ah, horrid brutes. We'll show you, horrid, you entitled little brats. You'd better get lost. Wah. <laughs> Acting? <laughs> Who do these grubby goons think they are? Ransacking my beautiful town. These sword can't make anything beautiful themselves. So all they do is wreck and ruin. Well, it won't stand. Someone has to stop these bullies. It's time for me to join the fight. All right, Violet. Mojam gang, let's do this. Alright, I think we got a whole other stage to go. Uh, so we're going to wrap up this episode today. Uh, we're going to pick it up next time. I appreciate you guys so, so much. Uh, leave me a like if you like our content. Subscribe. You're going to be here next time we get an episode. Uh, yeah, see you next time, guys. Bye. Thanks.